I'd like to show you how you can delete activities, resources, and everything else as a teacher. First of all, we're in Moodle for Teachers, and this is Moodle MOOC 5, but it could be any other Moodle course. Let's take a look at this particular one. You go into My Courses, and you will find that you're enrolled in one Moodle course, either non-beginners or beginners, a manager course, and a teacher practice course. So we're going to go into the teacher practice course right here. Click on it. And we're taken to the course. Now this is a public free course. And that's why I'd like you, because there's so many participants, to help out with deleting your work once you're finished documenting and creating your videos. So let's take a look and see how it's done. First of all, you need to turn editing on because you're here as a teacher. So let's do that. Turn editing on by clicking on it. And then notice it's changing its color to red. Here it is, uh, now it's red. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're going to remove your work. Okay, and this is how it's done. For example, you go into the edit. Of course, this is after you turn editing on. Okay, so remember that. So let's open the menu here. We open it up and we go to delete. And you click on delete. Okay, so delete is right here. That's where you click delete. Okay, let me uh, show you. For example, I'm going to create something so that I can delete it. All right, are you ready? All right, so let me go into activity. Create something. I'll create a certificate. Add it. creating an activity so I can delete it. So I'll call this form delete. Okay, and description, delete, and then no description, everything else is fine. Notice all these things that you should be aware of. Go in, take a look at them, practice using them, so you'll remember, all right? And then, now I'm going to go back, notice, uh, from my delete area to the resource and up to here is the course the rest is something else okay you've got the category there so let's go into the resource area where I want to delete this or at least demonstrate how I delete things so here's my delete discussion form now I've got a delete in two places. Okay, these are the two places. In the delete area notice, it was duplicated. Okay, because I clicked on duplicate. Now you gotta be careful here because I'm duplicating it, okay, three times. Now notice I'm gonna have to delete it three times. So let me open up the edit again. Okay, the right one, not somebody else's, and go into delete. There's other information here like duplicate. Are you sure? Yes. So I deleted one. Next one, notice I'm going here, delete, it's gone. Actually, it's a lot of fun deleting things. Okay, and there, I've deleted everything that I wanted. Otherwise, I'm gonna leave this for other people to delete. I see that many have already. Okay, so that's the resources. Let's go into the activity area where there are also practice activities. Okay, and let's see how many there are here. All right, so pretty good. I see that uh, people have deleted them, which is a good thing. All right, so here they are. These will have to be deleted. Okay, all of these. So please do, so that we don't do it for you. Okay, so make sure that you've got your work done. You've uh, 
manage to document everything and do all you need. Now, if you find that you miss something, you delete and then you come back and you can do it all over again, which is fine. Okay, as long as you delete, you can come back and do it all again. And that's it. I hope this has been of help. I just want to inform you that if you look at the browser window here, you've got a link. And if you're having problems on a certain page, you can always link it. You can also get a screenshot, capture the screen so that I know what you're talking about when you refer to something. And you'll need to teach your students to do the same. I use Jing, but you can use any other image capture program. All right, so thank you everyone. I hope this has been of help as I've said, and happy moodling as always.